This is Gene Key, KDD News. ConnectAmarillo.com reports a restaurant owner was sentenced in federal court on Tuesday for dealing counterfeit currency. Shannon Nicole Washer, 36 of Borger, was sentenced to 10 months in federal prison to one count of dealing in counterfeit currency. Washer pleaded guilty in October 2011. According to court documents, she owns a restaurant in Borger. The document said she passed $440 in counterfeit currency at Buttons, Bows and Balloons in Panhandle on August 12th. Washer also passed $180 in counterfeit money at Allsup's in Dumas. On the same day, according to documents, she attempted to pass more money at other gas stations here in Dumas. Amarillo.com reports Amarillo police are searching for a man who they say exposed himself to a high school student Wednesday, according to police. A white minivan pulled into the Amarillo High School parking lot near a 15-year-old girl when a young man exposed himself. The man is in his late teens or early 20s. Very good news for Dumas residents requiring regular dialysis treatments. No more trips to Amarillo. Access Care Dialysis in Dumas received its Medicare certification on Wednesday. There'll be planning a grand opening in February. This means any dialysis patients in Dumas would no longer have to drive all the way to Amarillo for care. Instead, they can receive it here in Dumas. If you'd like the latest Dumas, Panhandle, and Texas news on your mobile device, you can follow KDD News on YouTube. Simply search KDDD or Gene Key on Facebook or Twitter. This is Gene Key, KDD News.